Welcome Dart players one and all. Today on Straight to the Point we're going to be taking a quick look at my new darts that are actually available for sale. In this video I'm not going to give you my opinion on the darts because I've designed these darts for me. I'm going to like them. I'm going to give you the specs on them and if you do want to order a set there'll be some details on how you can do that as well. These are the darts we're talking about today. They're very short and extremely grippy and the grip actually goes all the way back to the shaft of the dart, very, very close to the rear. The grip in the middle again is very grippy, even more grippy than the rear. Of course, this is very difficult to get in focus. So we'll get some close-ups and we'll go through some of the dimensions. So here's a close-up of the front of the dart. You can see there's quite a flat bull nose on there, a little bit like something James Wade would use. And it's all completely clear tungsten. There's no paint on there at all. You can see just how far back that grip goes. It's very close to where the dart meets the shaft. It's one continuous grip. And there's a bit of a taper at the rear, so there's plenty of grip for a rear gripper. The middle grip is very, very grippy, but it's parallel. So these darts are actually designed to be a little bit front heavy. They are made of 90% tungsten and at the moment they're only available in 22 grams. But I'm looking to do a run of 24s as well. They all come fitted with a standard black 32mm point. Which is about standard. It's what typically comes on most darts out of the box from manufacturers. And now for the dimensions. Okay so at the rear of the dart you can see it joins the shaft very flush. And it tapers up to 7 mil, and on that section you've got 13 mil of rear grip. The grip is quite fine and edgy, it's very similar to something you may have seen Gary Anderson using in the past. Followed by a very small smooth section just to allow a gap for my fingers, and then we have the grippier section of all in the middle, 13 mil of a big double ring grip. And this double ring grip in the middle is cut quite fine, it's very sharp and edgy. And there's quite big grooves in between them. To sum these darts up, I'd say if you've enjoyed a Steve Beaton dart, but you'd like a lot more grip, these could be for you. And they currently retail at £35 per set. We'll just have a quick look at the way the dart lands in the board now. So as you can see, that's perfect for me. I do like the darts to land upright in the board. That's why I hold it right at the back on that rear taper. And this allows the dart to kick in the air and land upright also aided by the weight at the front of the barrel. The dart is slightly wider than some for the weight, but you can see there's still plenty of room in the treble 20. And if I can go above the treble or in the top of it, it actually makes the target quite a bit bigger, because I can just go in off the barrel. As long as I don't pull this one, I should be in. And that's the face of a man who's pulled the dart. But that's it for today. Thank you for watching Straight to the Point. Please remember to like and leave a comment. And as always, subscribe if you love the dance. Roll the credits.